Welcome. In front of me is a Sony Xperia 1 Mark IV and today I'll show you how you can enable and set up your portable hotspot. So to get started, pull down your notifications, expand them and in here we should find a toggle for it. So for me it's on the second page, hotspot. Now when doing this the first time you want to hold this toggle. This will quickly take you to the settings where you can change some of them. Now, most important thing that you probably want to change will be the hotspot password. Without actually going in here, you most likely won't know what it is. Uh, now, this one is actually quite weird. Now, I don't know if this is a default one. It doesn't actually look like it, so maybe someone actually changed it. Um, I think default it will be just some random letters and numbers. This is a little bit more easy to remember but still without going here you wouldn't know what it is now what i recommend actually doing with it is removing your basically the default password and setting up your own which needs to have at least eight characters in length at which point you can save it by tapping on ok next thing you could do is just change the hotspot name which will be the um just a wi-fi that this will the hot, this hotspot will create so that's the name you'll be looking for. It has a little bit wonky, Xperia 8920, so you could change it to something a little bit more uh, suitable. So you can change the name entirely, or maybe shorten it to be something like Xperia 1, uh, which will be a little bit easier to probably find and realize which is yours. Apart from that, we have also the turn off hotspot automatically, which I recommend keeping. It will disable it after 10 minutes of an activity, which is a really nice feature. And lastly, we have the use 2.4 GHz only, uh, which is actually turned off, meaning that right now the device, once you enable your hotspot, will use 2.4 GHz Wi Fi along with 5 GHz. So you can utilize a faster network if whatever the device you will be connecting to it with actually supports the 5. If it doesn't, it will then utilize the 2.4. So, anyway. From here we can just close this once it's set up and now all we need to do is tap on that toggle to actually use our hotspot whenever we need it. And like the settings suggested, after 10 minutes of an activity it would turn off automatically but you can also do it yourself quicker by going back to the toggle, tapping on it once more to turn it off. So anyway, if you found this very helpful don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.